Hi everybody, um, I'm going to show you today how to crush a can with water. It's a fun experiment that I learned in my school at science class. Alright, so the first thing you want to do is go down here and turn one of the uh, heating elements on to high. As you can see there. Uh, now watch, it. yeah, it's turning red, so you're going to wait a second for that to heat up. Alright, now the second thing you want to do as you're waiting for that to heat up is go over here. These are some of the elements that you may need. Um, some ice in a cup. So, as you can see, I have some in there. Um, any measuring mechanism uh, that shows a tablespoon. And a Diet Coke can, as I have right here. Any can will work, though. Um, and about a pot of water. And some tongs, kitchen or stove. Um, so, as you can see, that's pretty hot now. So you want to take your tongs, make those ready, and the can. Now, as you can see, this is a tablespoon measuring. You want to take about a tablespoon of water in there and pour it in your can. And you want to take your tongs and grab your can. Put it on the stove. And the stove is very hot, so you want to remember in this experiment, safety first. Alright, so now while we're waiting for that, we will set the timer to kitchen timer and one minute. And then we're going to press start. So as you can see, that that's counting down. And over here, we want to take our ice in there and pour it in our pot of water. Alright, so as you can see, that this is almost empty. Didn't pour all of them in there, but that should be enough to cool up that water quite a bit. Alright, now as you can hear, the uh, water in there is starting to boil and it's starting to emit some vapor, water vapor, um, and that's just about ready. So we got about 20 seconds left. We're almost there. Now at about 15 seconds, which is what it is right now, you want to be getting your tongs ready to grab your can. As you can see, I'm getting my grill tongs ready. Alright. So you'll hear the timer go off any second now. Alright, that's that was the timer. So now, it's pretty steamy, so we want to take this and dump it in the water. As you could hear, that that was a pretty nice, pretty nice one. And as you can see, the can is pretty nicely crushed. Okay, so remember, you want to empty out the can very carefully because that's pretty hot water. Alright, so I, th I hope you enjoyed my video and I'll make more as soon as I can. Bye.